Hey guys, it's Mel. Welcome to Miscellaneous Mondays. Uh, I don't have a lot to show you today, but I did make a card. I have a lot more cards, a lot of thank you cards to make. Um, so that's about all I did. But before I forget, I just want to make it a point to um, introduce, there's going to be a guest designer on Saturday. Um, and she, her name is Teresa and she's a very good friend of mine and I just hope that you guys are following these series and, um, and watch for her Saturday video because she's a good friend of mine and, um, she's new to videos on YouTube. She's, she's done a couple so far. So I just want to encourage you all to go ahead over and make sure, um, you look out for her on Saturdays. Um, and for today's Miscellaneous Mondays, it's probably, I apologize, it's probably going to be shorter today. I just wanted to share a card that I made. Um, nothing special, but I just wanted to make a um, thank you card. And um, this is what I came up with. Um, I probably can't read that too well here on the camera, but it says gratitude. And this is just a stamp. It's actually, I think, a fall stamp or like a Thanksgiving type stamp that I got it Tuesday morning. And this is very sad, but this is about the only, I only have a couple, like, we'll call them scenery stamps. Um, I don't have many that are just like a calm, you know, thing to put on. Like a lot of my stuff is like, I guess, kitty stuff due to the fact that I have a young daughter. Um, so I'm going to have to, <laughs> that's my edge. She's standing over me. Um, so due to the fact that I have a young daughter, a lot of my stuff is, you know, more on the kitty side, which is fine for usual, but then there's times where you want something a little more serious. So, and those of you who know me, I'm normally doing haul videos and shopping. I haven't even been shopping. I just haven't been feeling it. So um, eventually at one point, but that'll be something I'll have to look for. So anyway, this is one of the 49 cents, ugh, 49 cents stamps that I've gotten at Michael's and never used yet. And I just used my Copic, and I think I used peach and like a, um, I think it's called pale yellow Copic, um, and just blended those two together because I thought those colors were pretty. And then I just pulled out of my scraps, like little scrap papers, because I haven't done a lot of cards like this where, um, I've been seeing you guys do them. Just layering, you know, any mismatched way you layer the papers, it can really like give it something instead of just this plain. And now that I look at it, I wish I embossed this, but I already, um, used my ATG gun and I didn't want to rip everything off. So here's the stamp that I used and I just matted it, a little tulip, and I just matted it with a yellow paper from part of my scraps. And then this is from the 6x6 paper pad that I've been using the heck out of. And I used to, like I said, I used to um, underlook those uh, paper pads and um, think, what am I going to do with them? Because I was mainly a scrapbooker. But um, <clears throat> I found a use for them. So that's what I used that. And here I used my um, crinkle seam binding that I ordered from the Etsy seller in one of my past videos. I think I gave, I think it's Sherry's Paper Trail um, on Etsy that I ordered this from. And this is in lemon tart. So I just used that and did a little bow and added a pop dot behind it. And I just went with my, I don't know if you can see it, but just so it didn't look so stark white, I just went with the edge of my Copic marker just to give it some inking around the edge. And I added a little bit, I, I trimmed a little small little sliver of my um, mesh bling. And that was the front. And then I just did a little something on the inside. Just add the same matching thing and a thank you. And I want to write a nice little little note in there. So that's just what I wanted to share with you. Just a little card that I made. So I had to make like a little more serious one. And this is going to go to somebody that I really owe this card to. Um, so I want to finish writing that out and get that out in the mail. Um, I hope you all guys had a great Easter. I've been busy with that. And, you know having my little Easter egg hunt or whatever it is that you guys celebrate if you don't celebrate Easter um, but stay tuned for Rashida's tried out Tuesdays um, coming up tomorrow and again look out on Saturdays um, for my friend Teresa um, who will be we'll say guest starring on Saturday so hi Teresa hope you're watching hope you're doing well um, and I will talk to you guys soon have a good week bye